Welcome. In this screencast, you'll learn how to use the activity and participation report in Moodle 1.9. This tutorial is suitable for teachers who are fairly new to Moodle. To view the full-size tutorial, go to www.moodletutorials.org. We are going to begin at the course homepage, logged in as a teacher. To access the activity and participation report, select Reports from the administration box. Let's select the activity report. The activity report displays the number of views each activity has received. For instance, the news form under week zero has received five views, the latest on Friday the 18th. If you click on one of the links, it will take you to that activity. As expected, we've been taken to the news form. Let's return to the reports page. We are now going to examine the participation report the first option you must choose is the activity type you wish to report. The next option allows you to select the period of time. Show only allows you to run the report for either students, teachers, or guests. Finally, you may pick what actions to show. To run the report, click Go. If there is more than one activity of the same type, you will need to select which one. I will pick the example form, then click Go. You will see the definition of what is considered an action. Below is the report showing all students and if they have completed the action. An incredibly powerful tool is the Add Send Message feature. This enables you to send a message to any student you select. Conveniently, there is a Select All No button. This allows you to easily bulk email students who have not completed a certain action. This concludes the tutorial on activity and participation reports. Remember, to access the reports, select Reports in the administration box. The activity report shows the number of views of activities. This can be useful for seeing what is popular in your course. The participation report allows you to check whether or not students have completed an action for a certain activity. It also allows you to bulk message students who have not completed the action. To view the full size tutorial, go to www.moodletutorials.org.